Hi guys, so I know it's over a week late, but I wanted to do my November monthly haul for you guys. Um, the reason why it was so late was because I was horrifically ill for like four or five days at the very start of December, so I was like completely incapable of even getting out of bed, let alone getting presentable and making videos. Um, but I'm all better now and I actually just bought a whole load of stuff today. Um, even though it's December, I'm going to include it in my November haul because the December haul is basically just uh, what I got for Christmas haul anyway. And I got a whole bunch of stuff so I wanted to show you guys. So if we start with one of the things that's in the thumbnail of this video, I got a pair of Demonias off of eBay for legitimately £15. I won them and I can't believe it. They're amazing. Um, they were like practically brand new and they were just awesome and they're like my favourite boots now. I've been wearing them pretty much every single day and they're just perfect. I just, just, just look at them. They're just, they're so pretty. So I also finally got a large enough ball for my rats. Here's Zero modelling, modelling it, isn't it? It's so cool. I've been looking to get like a big massive one for ages and now I have one. So I've got a lot of different kinds of things here so I guess I'll just talk about them as I pull them out in no particular order. Um, so if we start with my bucket, one of the first things is this really awesome little top and I got this from Primark and I don't usually shop in Primark, I'm kind of against it but I was in getting something for a shoot and I saw this and I was like this is so me, it's like black and orange and it's so Halloween-y and it was just like in amongst all the Christmassy stuff and it's just She's really cute and I needed more kind of long sleeved tops for like winter and fall so yeah. And I got a bunch of cheap crap off eBay from like China. Um, so this is like a really cheap uh, contact lens holder case. Um, when I take my contact lenses with me usually, like before I had this, um, it would be such a pain having to take like a full bottle of solution and then like everything was kind of more bulky. But inside here there's a little mirror and then there's the little bit for storing your contact lenses and then you can actually put the sterile solution in a little um, in a little container and then there's also a little pair of tweezers for holding on to your contact lenses and stuff that's so cute. So yeah I'm like really happy with this. I got it off eBay, it's really easy to find. Um, it was about a pound or two and yeah it's really cute. Another cheap Chinese eBay thing I got was this little macaron jewellery holder and it just sort of pops open and you can put like little bits of jewellery and stuff in it and this is just like going to be so useful. I take like my earrings out and then I put them in my bag or my purse and I'm always afraid I'll lose them so now I've got a cute little thing. You get them in a bunch of colours as well and this was about a pound odd as well. And then it's all tangled but I also got this really cheap um, kind of decorative body chain type thing off of eBay as well. Um, it's kind of hard to show off when it's all tangled but it kind of comes round and down a couple of times here and it's going to look really cool for like a couple of shoots I've got planned. So I'm like super excited. And then the last thing in my bucket is a new eyeliner. This is one of the eyeliners I use. I use like three different types of eyeliner to do my eyes and this is the main one. Do you ever get that way where you just use your old eyeliner to death and you don't even realise how like crusty and gross it's got until you get a new one? Yeah, that happened. Um, so if I show you, this is the new one. Oh, the kind I use is the Avon Super Extend Eyeliner. So they're the exact same kind but the one on the top is the old one and at the bottom is the new one and you can see how like gross and grey the old one's got and I hadn't even noticed. I just kept using it I've probably been using it for too long but I just haven't got around to getting a new one but now I do so I'm like super happy. I've also got some new incense. This is the Midnight kind by Satya and um, I'm really looking forward to trying this. I've got another kind. I've got this one Jasmine Blossom and my flatmate hates the smell of this so I can't really use these. I quite like it but she can't stand it so I had to get a new set. I got a bunch of cosy socks for Christmas, some like black and white ones and then some purple ones, these are just from Primark as well. And I get three more bars of Dove soap, this is just what I use to wash my face every day and I was running out so now I've got an extra free. And then because I was ill, um, my face is all like, the skin is all dry and gross, um, so I bought a bunch more uh, face masks and stuff. 
So I get a couple of the Montagne Jeunesse ones. Um, these are the kind that I use all the time. Um, so I get two Manuka Honey ones. These are like my go-to peel-off ones. Um, I always use these before a shoot and there's enough in here that you can use like a single packet, maybe two, even three times. So it works out pretty good. Um, and then I also got a blemish mud mask just in case I break out before a shoot. Um, these are like my holy grail face masks for pre-photo shoot preparation. I also got a couple of other kinds because I wanted to kind of try some more out. So I got this really cheap one that's just like a spa exfoliating mask and it's got peach and apricot kernel oil and it's got two different sachets in it. I'll see what that does. And then I get a bunch of strip things to see if I can like sort out the problem areas that I have now from being ill and like not keeping up with my skincare stuff. So I get some nose pore ones. I've like never used um, cleansing strips before so this is kind of new to me. I've got some ones for my nose. I've got ones for my chin and my forehead. Um, and then I've also got some wrinkle care eye gel patchy things. They were just like all the same kinds. Um, but yeah, I'll try those out as well. And then the last two things I got from Paper Chase. I love Paper Chase, but it's so expensive. But I found out that um, they've got a student discount, so it wasn't too bad. Um, so the first thing I got was this new fold away bag type thing and it's got a little carabiner on it so I don't lose it and I can just pop it in my bag. It's nice and compact so it's pretty cool and the print's pretty cool as well. Um, I like Paper Chase's stuff but none of their stuff is like dark or alternative enough for me so it's kind of hard for me to get a whole load of stuff. Um, the last thing I got was this for keeping my rail cards and stuff in. This is quite bulky and sturdy as well so hopefully I don't lose it. And yeah, that's just about everything I got this month. Um, I got a whole bunch of stuff and yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys very soon. Bye bye.